So we've been talking about TWI and we've been talking about how it looks like in a small group context, what we love about it, what we enjoy about it, the simple TWI model. Um, let's just break it down and talk about Thanksgiving, worship, and intercession separately. Let's talk real quick about Thanksgiving. We talked a little bit about it in the first video, but what what about Thanksgiving stands out to you? Mm -hmm. That's good. As it pertains to prayer. Yeah. yeah. I think the thank the Thanksgiving we're coming in offering mm. it's a sacrifice offering yeah. like a free will offering saying hey we're I'm coming in and it could be anything and everything yeah. and I love mm -hmm. that we use that phrase um, because the thanks that we offer I mean it's just like I just want to start getting my heart moving yeah. and shifting towards re recognizing what God has done mm. um, yeah. so I just want to get like my heart pump going in yeah. Thanksgiving yeah that's good. I agree. I just I think about the scripture that, that says to give them an offering of thanks or praise, and uh, uh, I think it's as simple as as you see that theme throughout the Old Testament of they were putting offerings on an altar, and when you put an offering on an altar, the fire consumes it. And so mm -hmm. when you're thanking yeah. Him, all you're doing is you're you're laying down that offering. Mm -hmm. It's as simple as laying down. <laughs> it's like you're just laying down this offering. And right when you lay it down, then the fire consumes it, and you're yeah. in a revelation of Jesus together, yeah. encountering God, you know, with whoever you're with. Mm -hmm. And uh, just knowing how simple, like, think about, I mean, like, just laying it down. <laughs> it's like, here's the thing. <laughs> That's all you're doing, you know. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's just crazy how moved God is, how loved he is by Thanksgiving. And yeah. that's how we do it. You know, we're not trying to manipulate God or all this stuff. It's like he likes when we thank him, and so mm -hmm. we thank him. <laughs> that is so good. And uh, so, yeah. I, think that's I love the – it really does get the motor going for mm -hmm. all of us, especially mm -hmm. if I've had a rough day. Mm -hmm. When I can thank him, it's like it's like that act of remembrance mm -hmm. that stirs my heart towards him again. I'm like, oh, yeah, you're – like, honestly, what I – think so many times when I start thanking him is I start realizing again that he's real. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. oh my gosh, you're real. Mm -hmm. yeah. You care. Yeah. What? Wow. Okay. You're not just a figment of my imagination. Mm -hmm. You're not just the background thought of my day. Mm -hmm. Like, okay, no, I'm here for you. And it recalibrates my heart. It gets the motor going to see him for the fire to fall. Mm -hmm. I honestly, well, there's hard points at different, uh, there's hard things that people have trouble with on each one of these things. Mm -hmm. Uh, I would say for Thanksgiving, probably the the hardest thing is for people to stay in Thanksgiving. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah. because everyone wants to move on to the intercession or like the more exciting stuff, yeah. mm -hmm. but we don't realize, first of all, how many things there are to be thankful for, yeah. and how important it is. Yeah. Like, pe or people mm -hmm. just want to start futuristically thank him. Like, yes. thank you. They could start going into intercession Thanksgiving. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which it, it it's it's nice, and I mean, again, not bad. I'm not. There's nothing bad about it, but. Yeah. Staying in Thanksgiving, just talk about it real quick. Yeah, wow. I feel like even the past couple of weeks for me, in starting Jesus Our Times and in, in TWI of Thanksgiving, it's like we've just stayed on Thanksgiving for the first 15, 20 minutes, which mm -hmm. is not normal. Mm -hmm. But it's been so rich because mm -hmm. we recognize like we're not moving on from this place mm -hmm. until we understand that like he really is worthy of our thanks. Yeah. Yes. And just the power of saying, hey, yeah. I'm going to keep giving thanksgiving until I even come into alignment with the fact that he's worthy of my thanksgiving. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. I, I just think about too, like I want to give him a good offering. Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, it's like I... Like, I want to give him something, like, lovely. Like, I want to give him something that blesses him and makes him feel mm -hmm. honored and loved. And so I'm not trying to hurry through it mm -hmm. because I'm trying to give him an offering that's worthy. Like, the mm -hmm. Bible talks about having walking in a way that's worthy of that which you've been called. And so when I'm coming in, it, it's no performance. Yeah. It's just a desire of, like, man, I want to love you mm -hmm. so well in this moment. Like, yeah. I want to thank you until you come. I want to be... I want to be okay thanking you like the rest of my life, you know, yeah, like, yeah. like, and I think that's what I love about it is it, there's no performance about it. It's just pure love. Yeah. Like we want to purely love Jesus mm -hmm. and we want to give him something that's worthy of him, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so 
when we're in Thanksgiving, that like we come in slow with that. We're not in a hurry. Yeah. We're not trying to get past it and hurry to the next thing. Yeah. It's like, oh, we're just here to love you, Jesus. Yeah. Like, I'll thank you all day if it's blessing your heart, yeah, yeah. you know. And then just out of his grace and mercy, he, he releases a revelation, you know. And you're like, oh, now we're in worship, and I barely even realized it. It yes. just came upon me, yeah. <laughs> you know. And so That's a, yeah. I, I think also about uh, Thanksgiving when it's the offering of my will. Mm-hmm. Is it's the offering of my will to enter in to His presence, mm-hmm. and I, I love what you're saying. Where I'm trying to remember the thought I had now, mm-hmm. but thanking Him, uh, we're gonna have to probably come back to it later. But I, I forgot. It. But anyways, <laughs> Thanksgiving is a, a really powerful tool. Mm-hmm. Um, dang it. Okay, hold on. Give me a second. We can skip the video, but we get. I'm, I'm gonna remember this. This is a good thought. <laughs> Not performing, thanking Not performing him because him. we love him. Thank- ah, yes. yes. Okay. The other thing I love th- about Thanksgiving is that it reorients us to giving to him. Yes. When we come yes. in, I think oh. so many times we come in, what am I going to receive? Mm-hmm. Yeah. What are we going to yeah. experience? Yeah. What's going to be the moment? What's yeah. going to be the But it like yeah. reorients me yes. to the fact that like, no, I'm here to give. Yes. Like, like yeah. I love receiving from him. Yeah. But as every healthy relationship, it's giving to each other. Yes. So I, that when I'm bringing an offering, it's not striving. It's yeah. not. It's, yes. it's 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 like you said. It's me relating to him. And it's me reorienting my heart. Okay, this mm-hmm. is about him. Yes. yes. This is about you, Jesus. Yeah. Yes. And, and so that that's what I love. Thanksgiving does it reorients my it, it primes the pump. Yes. It creates an offering for him to fall on. Yeah. It, 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 it and and it reminds me that, okay, this meeting is about him. Yes. It's not about what I'm going to get out of yes. it. It's not about, it's going to be about what, even what's going to happen. It's gonna, this is about him. Yes. Yeah. So, wow. The phrase always comes to mind, mm-hmm. like, this is what we're here for. Mm-hmm. Like, Thanksgiving yeah. is what we're here for. Wow. Because yeah. even our worship of mm-hmm. him mm-hmm. is coming from a place of thankfulness. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like, this is what we're here for, is to yes. bring you praise and offerings yeah. of Thanksgiving. Yeah.